हेलो डॉक्टर अजय शर्मा डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स एंड कम्युनिकेशन इंजीनियरिंग जेम्स इंजीनियरिंग मैनेजमेंट टेक्निकल कैंपस ग्रेटर नोएडा द सब्जेक्ट दैट आई डील इन दिस सेमेस्टर इज डिजिटल कम्युनिकेशन दिस पर्टिकुलर सब्जेक्ट इज फॉर बीटेक फिफ्थ सेमेस्टर ECE students this is the main subject and uh, this subject is very important for the students uh, because uh, this uh, subject is related to communication and the student branch the student uh, engineering branch is electronics and communication in this so communication word uh, come in the uh, main branch uh, name That the student have, so communication is uh, very much important for ECE students, and this is uh, communication part two, which we called as digital communication. Part first is analog based communication that uh, all uh, that particular subject already be uh, already already be covered by this student in fourth semester. Now the topic that I discuss today is Rayleigh distribution. that rayle distribution are also called as f distribution so f distribution is same as rayle distribution and uniform distribution actually uh, as far as the rayle or f distribution is concerned the in probability theory and statistics the rayle distribution also called f distribution is a continuous probability distribution for non negative valued random variables it is essentially a child distribution with two degree of freedoms try to understand this particular uh, concept actually this particular rayleigh or f distribution have two uh, different random variables you know actually rayleigh distribution is the resultant of two different random variables and uh, this particular rayleigh distribution defined for non negative values means whatever the values that this random variable have is greater than 0 at least that's why we called it a non negative value and this particular distribution have two different distribution it is the resultant of two different distribution two different probability distribution and the these two different uh, probability distribution are actually follow gaussian uh, distribution so main points regarding this f or rayleigh distribution is it is a continuous probability distribution second the f statistic is the ratio of two sample variable variances two sample variances means each two sample one variance relate to uh, one uh, gaussian random variable uh, another sample variance have uh, uh, other uh, gaussian uh, distribution because what we what we what we what we what i told uh, about uh, this rayleigh distribution i told that this this uh, f distribution is the resultant of two different distributions so when you have a two different uh, probability distribution that we called as a gaussian distribution each gaussian dis distribution have a each variance so that's why this uh, rayleigh distribution is the ratio of two sample variances means variance of uh, one random one gaussian random variable upon variance of second uh, gaussian random variable so uh, third point is uh, this f distribution or rayleigh distribution have two sets of degree of freedom the meaning of this point is, is this particular uh, distribution involves two different gaussian random variables fourth one is degree of freedom are based on a sample size and used to calculate the numerator and denominator of the ratio okay so uh, a example of this distribution arises in the arises in the case of random complex numbers whose real and imaginary components are independently and identically distributed gaussian with equal variance and zero means try to understand this point again actually what i said this this f distribution is the resultant of two gaussian distributions right uh, the two gaussian zahir si baat hai you know the two gaussian distribution have to uh, come from two gaussian random variables so these two gaussian random va variables Uh, have equal variance and zero mean means their mean are at zero and they have equal variance this is the condition so the condition is that rayleigh distribution is the resultant of two identical distributed gaussian uh, distribution with equal variance and zero mean this is the condition 
so the probability density function of the Rayleigh distribution is shown in this particular figure. If you see this particular figure, what you have to see, you see that this is def this is defined uh, a, uh, after zero or at zero. So that why that 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 I said uh, in previous slide that it is a non-negative. This variable is a non-negative number. So that is the picture that shows clearly. So the notation x really sigma means that the random variable x has a daily distribution with shape parameter the probability distribution x greater than equal to zero that we already defined. So what I said this again I said that daily distribution x actually is the resultant of two different random variables whose distribution follow Gaussian that is the mean and the the two random variable the, 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 the variables have equal mean and at zero mean this is the condition and look at the shape look at the shape of uh, this uh, uh, distribution uh, this shape is broadened as the as the parameter sigma is to be uh, you know uh, decreasing look at the sigma at 0 0.5 then uh, 0 0.4 right so as the shape parameter increases the distribution gets wider and this is the mathematical expression to calculate this particular uh, distribution. So from that mathematical expression, these the particular graphs are to be drawn for different values of sigma, right? Then come to uniform distribution. Uniform di distribution, as the name suggests, it is a, this distribution is uniform of all the random variables. Means all the events have the have the exact same probability of happenings anywhere within a fixed interval. So there, even, there, there is a fixed interval, there is a fixed sample space where all the random variables have the equal probability, right? So when displayed as a graph, each bar has approximately the same height. Look at this uniform distribution. So uh, however, it is important as a reference distribution. So uh, this uniform distribution, is that type of distributions whose probability distribution is uh, uniform of all the for all the random variables right so this is a uniform uh, distribution sometimes it is also called as a rectangular distribution because the shape that is, comes out to be look like a rectangular so that's why it's called a rectangular distribution. thank you very much